Sometimes in life you just gotta say fuck it. No, Phuket. You just gotta say Phuket Lager. And this is a lager beer that's sold in Thailand. It's named after a popular vacation destination in Thailand. Uh, Phuket, which is like an island part of Thailand uh, down south. And um, yeah, this beer is owned by a Thai company, but they have to brew it in Vietnam because of the way the laws are here. Imagine having a beer company in America where you have to, you can't legally brew it in your own country. You have to send it to Canada or Mexico and then have it have to pay import duties to get it back into America. I, that would be crazy, but that's the way it is here in Thailand. They can't brew their their own beer in their own country. They can only, only Singa, Leo, and Chang. I think those are the only three. And those three might have like specialty beers from time to time, but those are the main three. Uh, anyway, I just had a taste of this beer. Um, it kind of reminds me of uh, the beers that I had in Vietnam. Um, it kind of reminds me a little bit of La Rue, which is a popular beer in Vietnam. That's L A. R-U-E, La Rue beer. Um, yeah, it sort of reminds me, oddly enough, like the beers in Vietnam. I guess it's not very odd since it is brewed there. And I'm sure the brewer there might use, um, they may even use a recipe that is similar or identical to one of their local beers for this one. And they just, you know, stick a different label on it. Who knows? Uh, I got to admit, I don't really love this beer. I mean, I'd rather have a Leo or... A singa then have this beer um, it's okay but is it worth paying the premium price uh, I really don't think so but once in a while you gotta have something different different flavor I do get sick of having uh, the local beers all the time um, this definitely doesn't hold a candle to my favorite South East, Southeast Asian mass marketed beer which is beer Lao I think beer Lao is the best mass marketed beer in Southeast Asia. Yeah, better than Tiger for sure. Anyway, I uh, probably won't be buying uh, this beer again, probably for another couple of years. Um, you might like it. I, I would recommend giving it a shot. If you're here in Thailand, why not? You might have a different opinion. All right, have a good idea. Oh, I just noticed that this has um, French on it. La beer originale de l'Ure, which is... Uh, Quite a common thing to see in Vietnam, of course, um, for historical reasons. Anyway, just thought that was kind of interesting. That's it for the video today. I got to go right now. See you later. This is the three-minute video. Bye-bye. Hope take care. Bye. See you later. Tune in next time for the next beer review. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.